Here's three strategies that I use to help clients buy and sell a home together in Minnesota. Strategy number one, we're gonna sell your property contingent upon buying another one. And Steve and I put together these really fancy Legos to help demonstrate the point. So uh, this represents your current home and this is the new home that you're wanting to buy. So if we're going to sell your home contingent upon buying the new one, we'll start by putting your current home on the market. Let's say on a Friday maybe. And then we'll go out looking that same weekend to find your new home. Now, because we're, we're talking about being in a seller's market right now, pretty good chance that we're gonna get your current home under contract before we can get the new home under contract. So what we're gonna do is when we write the contract on your home to sell, we're going to put in verbiage that means it's contingent upon you getting a purchase on a new property under contract, let's say within 14 days. If you don't get your new property also under contract, then we can go ahead and cancel the purchase on your current home. Or because the buyers most likely already been through uh, multiple offers, they lost out on a ton of different properties, they probably fought in multiples just to get your home, they're actually probably going to allow you to have extra time to continue shopping for that new home. So that's how we sell your current home contingent upon the purchase of a new home. Now strategy number two is actually gonna be the opposite. So uh, before we put your home on the market, we can also go out and start shopping for your home. Uh, if you actually find that one beforehand, a lot of times clients will they'll already find the property, they wanna buy it. And if you're in a seller's market and like enough to get that home under contract, we can actually do verbiage that's the opposite. So we can purchase this home contingent upon successfully selling your current home. Now we're gonna have to put that language in anyhow, but if you haven't already got your property into contract, this just gives you the right to get it on the market within a certain number of days and get that one sold. Uh, and then it's contingent upon the purchase of this one successfully selling on the current home. All right, now strategy number three is actually one of my favorites. It's newer and it's kind of rare, but if you can do it, it can be a huge game changer. And that's gonna be actually that you find a lender that can do a recast. Now I've got a couple of them in house that I can get you in touch with. Uh, if you wanna shoot me an info, my email's below. Um, but basically what it means is the lender truly lets you purchase the new home without having to be contingent on the current home's sale. So what we're gonna do is we'll go shopping for your new home, we'll get that property under contract probably through the inspection period, and then we're gonna be putting your current home on the market. We'll close on the first home, let's say at the end of uh, the following month. Well then hopefully, ideally, we'll close on the current home within maybe a week or two after. That enables you to move everything from your current home into your new home. Uh, if you've got some painting or carpet you wanna do on the new place, you can do that uh, before having to get out of your current home immediately. It gives you a little bit of time of having both properties. And then once you're in the new home, we can close on the current home. Now that I've told you what you want to hear, let me tell you what you actually need to hear regarding working all these strategies. There's numerous different ways that we can handle the sale and you need to hire an agent that's really, really good. Now don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to sell you on just hiring me. Uh, I can't even help most of you that are out of state. Uh, well, I can a little bit more about that later. Uh, but for the ones that are in Minnesota, you wanna interview an agent, you wanna make sure that they actually have uh, not just the hard skills of what they can do, but also the soft skills of understanding your needs, the buyers coming in, what you know, what each party needs and how to navigate which one of these is gonna be the right strategy for you. So, of course, I would love to get a call from you, but wherever you're at in the country, make sure that you hire an agent that's a rock star and is gonna negotiate the best circumstances for your next move. And if you are looking for somebody out of state, I've actually got a network that I can look up who's available in your area, top producers, and get you in touch with them as well. My name is Joe Carmack, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.